Yeesh, things went wonky just now. I had a phone call that I had to answer. I figured I would right before I started streaming. And then I went to pull my mic over and the whole mic stand came off its goddamn place. Came off the clamp. Bruh. Yeah, this game is gorgeous. You can tell. Medieval. Hell yeah. Oh my god, zombies in this game? No way. You've been playing Ogre Battle 64, bruh. I, um. Uh, I was playing Final Fantasy 14 two days ago and I got the Orban Monastery raid. I am just dying to play tactics right now. <laughs> Fuck you, I've already seen all that. You can get zombies in Ogre Battle if a character dies and you don't revive them. I like tactics. That's the one reason I didn't like Ogre as much is because the uh, the monsters. I genuinely don't like monster rearing in my strategy games. Semi-annual tactics stream win. I've been streaming for three years and I've streamed it once. Fire! Fire. Yeah, so when? Soon. Look at that goofy shit. I like how they were handled though. I'm not a big fan of monsters, but I didn't mind them in Ogre Battle 64. Uh. It has risen again. Sir Daniel Fortescue, see? The hero of Galomir who fell at the first charge. The fog of war and the shrouds of time conspired to turn the arrow fodder into the savior of the day. But we knows better. <laughs> what? You like the prompt the triangle to exit? Fate has given it a second chance. A chance to forget the ignoble truth. A chance to defeat Zarak and live up to the legend. We hope it as well. So yeah, uh, welcome to Medieval. I know literally nothing about this game. It was recommended to me by Sharkfield as something fun. So here we are. I got throwing daggers. I have played a wee bit of this, um, cause I had to get it like correct. You know what I mean? <laughs> like I had, I had to get it correct. So I know some buttons. Star rune required. But apparently this game was popular enough to warrant a remake or rema- re Yeah, no, complete remake. Which is kind of cool. Yeah, dude just spins his torso. And then you can get the little charge. Yeah! He'll double spin. And then, you know, you just got to bend it. Yeah, basically, you got the normal attack here, which is uh, a four hit. Th uh, no, three hit. I thought it was four. Swing, swing. St I don't really know. Sometimes it just goes. And then you got to spin. And uh, yeah. How you guys doing today? That wall looks like it has a hidden door. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> nope, can't make me. And here we are at the, the glorious world map. I'm doing fantastic. Jury duty for today was canceled, so I ain't even upset being at work. That's good, I guess. I'm telling you, you can come away with some fun jury duty stories. Why not? 
did all your GC turn-ins? I saw the picture. That's I was trying to tell you guys to do your damn GC turn-ins because you get paid. Shit, the star ones are like literally a level. I have been hit. God, the audio quality is just so jank. Spin! Spin! I'm ready for more! <laughs> Alright, I found out the cheese. This is so jank. Going to do the thing where I log into a less populated world until shit regulates? How do you log into a less populated world? Uh... Oh, heals. Nice. Sub command on login. They die to one charge swing. This is the strat. I will never get hit again. That's, I might try that myself, though I don't think that matters on the logging queue. Because I think the logging queue is a uh, data center wide, isn't it? I mean, it might not be, but I feel like it is. It does matter? Oh, shit. Monkeys. Logging queue is per realm. Hmm. So what would even be a lower populated server on wherever the fuck we are? I don't even know. Also, let me know if audio is good. As always, audio is a constant and ongoing issue. Y'all wanna fucking go? I heard some shit. Sword's ready for business. So oh, shit. <laughs> Camera, please. Oh god. Holy shit. I don't know what that means, but that's a good thing. I remember playing a demo of this forever ago. I've literally never missed that. I've, I've never even seen this game played. I know of it, and that's about the extent I got. These bitches think they're good. I'm good. These bitches ain't shit. Can audio be good if our ears aren't real? Bruh. I mean, this was PlayStation 1. If you weren't playing an RPG, you were playing some kind of arcade game. Uh, some kind of super video gamey video game, you know? Speaking of video gamey video games, uh, I own the Spyro trilogy. <laughs> Oh, this is the way I came. Alright, we've still got a little bit more, I guess, in the healing here, so... Yeah, we're good. <gasps> the chalice! Wait. I don't know where that is. Where is that? 
you expect me to know where the fuck that is? Did you know that if you go in the water, you die? <sighs> if you didn't know, now you know. I have to go find this chalice. <gasps> Life bottle! Motherfucker. I want up there. Brain says this is probably the way, right? Yeah. Damn it. I'm taking so much stupid damage. I hate stupid damage. It's GTA. Oh yeah, the old ones, yeah. Waste deep water is lethal. You could drown while standing. Yeah. Ah! Uh. All right, cool. What is this though? Why not? All right, we got to go look around for this chalice. There it is. Oh, it worked. The Hall of Heroes awaits. The object here is the chalice. Every time you dispatch an enemy, the chalice fr uh, fills a little more. Once it's full, it is yours to collect, and you will be worthy of visiting the Sacred Hall of Heroes to claim a prize. There's a chalice to be found in every region of Galumir. They are all hidden or well guarded. Only a true hero will collect the full set. My bones are hard for the chalice. <laughs> buys throwing daggers, proceeds to never use throwing daggers. Hey, don't call me out like that. I'll use throwing daggers. I'll get there eventually. Oh, I guess I can heal. <sighs> oh, uh, on the drowning thing, also remember, you could literally drown every time you take a shower. Marinate on that, huh? You could be dead the next time you shower. So do yourself a favor and don't shower and live forever. You can drown in a teaspoon of water. I don't feel like that's right. I feel like that's a little bit of a hyperbole, but uh, Welcome I don't to know enough to claim heroes, otherwise. Where the bravest warriors from history spend eternity. Feasting, singing, and arm wrestling. If they think you're worthy enough, you may be able to persuade them to give you a new weapon. Alright. It's a small amount. I feel like our lungs are bigger than that. To pay homage to the hero- yes, I know. Homage to the heroes, stand in front of their designated statues, and await spiritual guidance. Captain Fortescue, it's me, Canny Tim. Does the battle go well? <laughs> How I wish I could fight at your side again, sir. But hold, you could take my crossbow. It's got rapid fire and it can ricochet the darts off walls to shoot around corners. I used it at the Battle of Galamir. After you were slain, I shot Zarek's champion, Lord Kardok. A clean kill through the eye at some thousand yards. Uh -huh. 
Not that there's anything clever about shooting someone in the eye, sir. <laughs> oh! Goodbye, sir. Crossbow! I guess that's that's it. Oh, we give them the chalice and they give us a thing. Okay. And the throwing daggers are useless. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's not a real staircase. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Only when you are truly worthy as a hero will you be able to ascend to the higher level of this hall. When you have paid homage to all, I gotta say, homage to all the heroes in the lower hall, the ghostly stairs will then become solid. All right. The doors be a jiggling. You say it differently each time. How many different ways can I say it? It's like homage, homage, homage. <laughs> so <laughs> open. Kumagi. Oh, uh, Magi. How do I get out of here? I don't know how to get the fuck out of here. It's I, I realize I can't do that. That's, uh, the spell noise makes me think of Morrowind. I had to go back to the start and stop. Is her name Daniel Fortescue or something? Saving data. Beautiful. Up on Cemetery Hill. The Castlevania show used the skeleton screams or some monsters. Dude, in current day, I watched a TV show recently that had the goddamn Wilhelm scream. Why? <laughs> So, even from the shackles of death, my old enemy pursues me. You're too late, Fortescue. Already my army has risen from the grave. You will never leave this necropolis. <laughs> <laughs> you will never leave this necropolis. <laughs> That's, I feel... All right, it, it, it's it's we are in such an age of advanced sound effects and recording technology that you could literally just have someone go up to a mic, my mic, and just go, Aah! and that would be okay. Like, cut that, make it a sound effect. You're good to go. What up, Colin? How'd your games finish out last night? I just want to go fast. Hmm. I guess we can try new weapon. Let us try the crossbow. How do I? I need to spin. Oh 
Oh shit! Ah! It's a Maxi! Oh fuck! Oh damn! Alright. Please read. Please read. Of great archaeological interest, destroy the boulder and plunder the valuable treasure within. How does one destroy a boulder? I'm not Chris Redfield. Not for lack of trying either. All right, well... I have a feeling I'm gonna have to come back here with some kind of bomb weaponry. You know what I mean? Holy shit, it really is an XC! Stop. Bring it back. Bring it back. Oh, shit. I got this. Another copper shield. Is it good? What is this donkey clock? <laughs> Fuck off! We have failed the master. We give our lives. Give me that money. <sighs> Feels good, man. adventurer would be wise to be thorough in the exploration of an area. Hidden locations reap great rewards. I... Yes, I can go look around. A wispy health juice. You know what it's not, though? It's not bonus. Which is just sad. And uh, this is your reminder that Silk Song is vaporware and is not real. <sighs> ah! What the fuck are you? I got a club. <gasps> Bring it home, bitch. Oh my god, those guys hurt. Then you'll smash! stench of old witches. A coven of the warty old hags lived here once, unholy fires burning all night while they brewed up unspeakable muck in their cauldrons. They moved on years back, but the smell still makes our eyes sting. Cool, I guess. Get it smashed! Fuck you! Holy shit! That is a very satisfying, visceral hit to it.
a guide to covens for witches and witchcraft enthusiasts. A witch's coven would reach the height of its power only when all of their sacrificed flames were, or sacred flames were alight. Witches have been known to offer help to the questing adventurer if they are a reclusive people and have be, or have to be summoned by the aid of mystic charms of talismans. Let it be known that help from a witch is rarely given freely, and the witch will more often than not make a request of the adventurer before any such help is given. If seeking to summon a witch, remember that they are quite territorial. Any signs of previous witch activity in an area is a good indication that a witch can be called upon. Whatever fuck that means. Oh shit, my club is on fire. Is that good? There's my chalice, but how the f Isn't that a fun sound? <laughs> Is that a button or a brassiere? Oh! Can't do it off that, I guess. Yo! You fucking want some? Oh, the club. Oh, it is every swing. I thought it was like hits or something. That's fine. Level's over. I found the witch. Tell us me. Uh, the Hall of Heroes awaits. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. like a money bag, that rock that I just ran over. Oh, so the next steam sale is on the uh, 22nd, I think is when it starts, the winter sale. I don't really have anything I'm looking forward to, but I'm hoping no straight roads can go on sale. I might end up getting that. If it does, depending. I've still got some stuff, but I have so many games that I bought recently that I haven't played yet. All right, here we are at the Hall of Heroes again. Back from the battle so soon? It must think it is a hero by now. But only a true hero is worthy of a place in the Hall of Heroes. See the ghostly statue of your fraudster self? When it has turned solid, a true hero you will be. What is this? My Hero Academia? Come on. But I got a chalice. take more than an army of the evil dead to throw your strides at? I have something that may help you on your quest, Captain. I give it to you freely, though I have no idea what it is. Cool, I guess? I thought I was supposed to use the chalice to get sweet bonus. Is that not what was happening?
Stand in front of wait for spiritual guidance. Alright, so that's that's us. Huh. I don't know. I can't do anything else with these guys. I was hoping for a sweet new weapon, but whatever, we have a club. It's time to continue to smash. I don't know anything about this game. That's okay, we're learning together. Do not remove memory card. The Hilltop Mausoleum. Yeah, I know shit about this either, but I'm having a good time so far. The club is so visceral. Think it good? You fucking smashed, bitch. They think they're good. It's, it's a drive-by. I'm just going light speed smashing the shit out of these weird things. <laughs> Come on, baby. Yeah, new club. Yes, feels good, man. do with this oh nope it's a trick of the eye Watch out for sticky fingered imps. These thieves will strip you down to your armored undies. All right, there's a game that does that. One where the guy has the uh, the heart the heart boxers. Ghosts and goblins. Huh. Ow, ow! Or ghouls and goblins. Get crushed, son! Get me out, son! God, these spikes are fucking me up, dude. <laughs> I'm telling you, this club, it's one of the best things I've seen in a while. It's just so visceral. Stained Glass Demon is the master of the mausoleum. His wretched soul lies preserved inside a frozen glass heart. Shrouded in a veil of darkness beneath the mausoleum, you will find this pre-frozen menace. That was another one of those moments where I read it and didn't... I have no idea what the fuck I just read.
Mm, yes, we need the chaos rune. We're here to collect chaos. Help! My club! What the fuck do I have? Give me that bag! Fucking moon runes. Yeah, it was worth a try. Let's see. Nope. Don't need shit. The would-be Phantom of the Opera longs to play a new tune, but he seems doomed to repeat the same chords of despair over and over. So if we give him some sheet music, it's probably fine. He'll look around. Throwing daggers? Oh, the heart. If I block at all in this game, I would be surprising myself. Ah, oh, man. All right, I got to double back around. This way and then to the right. Ow. Tell what this attack does. No! Well, sometimes you, you you win it. Sometimes you fall into a pit. one supply him sir I need to talk to you I need a moment to talk to you about your car see that's uh, that was dumb why stop anything with it. None of my other buttons do stuff. Sir! Can I even, like, look to see my items or anything? I picked up the sheet meat. Maybe because I died? I don't have it anymore? 
That might be the case, actually, right? I don't know. There we go. Chalice! Yo, money! We got paid! There we go. What is this? a nap oh little baby need a nap honestly I, I I woke up not too long ago and I could also use a nap. <laughs> then again my nap would be more permanent please Demon's heart is his only vulnerable point. about to get my ass whooped touching him is bad shit shit Not sure what you're supposed to do if you don't have crossbow or throwing daggers at this point. when I go went under him I don't know what happened there he's almost dead though got his ass Thank you. Not bad. I mean, the fight wasn't the coolest in the world, but it could have been worse. Yeah. 
It's the Hall of Heroes shopping mall. Bargain hunters should check out the ground floor. Well-to-do shoppers should check out the upper floor. That's where it's at. <laughs> okay. I cannot check out the upper floor. Can I talk to this guy yet? I don't know what triggers this shit. Oh! New guy? Ah, Fortescue! Yeah, I saw the glow. I about that Archcad Zarog still being alive. Thought you killed the fella. <laughs> Never mind, you old warhorse. Better show him what's what, eh? I expect Johnny Zombie's a bit more of a handful than you remember. How are you doing for weapons? <laughs> Here, take my war hammer. Yes! It'll smash anything and it won't fall apart like a club. I only ever get to use it cracking walnuts around this place. <laughs> yes. Nonsense, Fortescue. I won't take no for an answer. Did I fat finger no? a few heads for old Stanier Iron Hewer, eh? Why even give me the option? But more importantly, now I have a permanent club. Oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. Now clubs are for lighting fires. Which, as all wood should be. It burns. Especially the tinderbox people call houses. Alright, uh, nope. All right, uh, return to the graveyard. I'm ready to smash! <laughs> Come here, bitch. I got business. Well, I learned many lessons that day. <laughs> Lesson number one being don't hit a bridge. But that's about all I got, actually. So yeah, we're back here. What are we doing back here? Yo, that doesn't even hit him and kill him in one hit. It's like the sword, but worse. Ah, uh, yes, of course. We are returning. That's why we're at the graveyard, obviously. Ooh, a silver shield. Catch me blocking, bitch. Light speed, just smashing shit. I love it. God damn it. God damn it, stop changing my camera. 
God damn it, stop moving the camera! Motherfucker! Bruh. It, I haven't touched the camera controls. Why is it like this? Why is every PlayStation game, PS1 game, have huge camera issues? I don't even know if there's stuff up there. Doesn't look like there is. Ow? It's just amazing to me that it took like... Uh, it took a while. You know what I mean? For, for cameras. And even then, I don't feel like they're fixed all the time. It's just some of the time. The living world lies beyond these skull gates. Um, isn't there, isn't that the opening the darker than black? Black, sorry, darker than black. The truth exists beyond the gates. The master of the hilltop mausoleum, the stained glass demon has possession of the skull key. Uh, key I have. Dog. Not today, nerds. This game's kind of kicking my butt. Forget that band. I used to listen to them a bit. Uh, the 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 guys who did the opening, Darker Than Black, Abingdon Boys School, I think. That sounds right. Want to be faster on your feet? Want to be able to bash down walls by charging into them? All you have to do is defeat the evil guardians of the graveyard and gain this new ability. You will never know why you left the grave without it. What up, Castro? Uh, dog, 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 dog. <laughs> That's, I'm kind of enjoying this game too. I've never... Play uh, shh, dog. I mean, ever since uh, what last level I've been getting my butt kicked, but that's to be expected. Realistically, I just want to go fast and never block. God. But how you doing today, Castro? Can I make? That's not a jump I can make. I'm not even gonna attempt that. I have no life bottles, so. We're gonna, we're gonna move on from this. Alright, so I didn't- Oh, I did. When did I pick that up? I went, oh, at the top of the hill. I was not paying attention. Even in the slightest. Shit! Uh. Uh. You motherfuckers, this is why I have to run with my shield raised. Bring it on, bitch. God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> My silver shield has never been the same. What 
if I try the hammer? I might be able to like pound him out. If I miss this, I die. Ooh. That's right, I blocked. And I acquired a chalice, but I'm di I'm dying, Squirtle. Shit, 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 shit! <laughs> Whoops. I gotta play extra pus. No, extra pus. God heals. Oh, um, I don't need any of this shit. I thought he was gonna have like maybe health or something. No, he's had the same stuff ever since I started playing. What is this exactly? Something splurching. What the fuck is that? Now you're gonna play PSP's Medieval? Was there one on the PSP? How many times did they, did they make this game? I know they have that remake for PS4, right? That is some splurch. Let's go see what's up the other up jump thing. I'm supposed to push this into the water, do you? It's- I was recommended this game from one of my mods. Told me it would be a fun little thing to do and- Oh god! So far he's right. I'm surprised I missed this on the PlayStation. Alright, cool. That that actually is what I need to do. Neat. Also, once again, ill-advised me lit this crazy ass candle. What is it again? Sugared lemon zest. Now all I smell is fruity pebbles. <laughs> It's, I can't do food candles. It, it don't work. Right. We're gonna push this one to... No! so boned. I'm going to fall into the water and I'm going to die. These are truths. Uh, you fucking what? I wanted to... There's gate. I gotta get by the gate. But 
this should be the way. Oh boy. There's some light platforming here. I am so screwed. Oh my god. <laughs> Boss fight? Prepare to battle the guardians of the graveyard. Dogs. Contact damage. dogs I don't know how to fight the ghost dogs touch bad touch bad touch Gin, but at what cost? My shield. Oh, the I'm, I'm straight up monster hunter clawing this shit. This is working. This is actually working. I don't know how, but I'll take it. No! <laughs> uh, it's no longer working. Outside the necropolis. Pearls go this way, pearls go that way. Nasty, painful death waits round every turn and over every hill. Bon voyage. That whooped my ass. I have I have no fucking clue how I was supposed to do that. <laughs> Genuinely no idea. I have 16 health. Feels good, man. All right, which one of you bastards is glowing? Same one. Bravo, Fortescue! Some of the other chaps wagered Zarok would be using your ribcage as a toast rack for now, but I knew you'd pull through. Here, I have a little extra something here I can give you. Could help the old quest. You want it? Is it five life bottles and a full heal? <laughs> Money? Money? I've been disappointed before. Also, am I supposed to like fill this chalice or something? Lurk. <laughs> I appreciate the lurk. Ain't no sub command for that. Hibernate? Nope, still ain't there. <laughs> Nightbot has two commands. Uh, Discord and the uh, MD.
what does the MD stand for, you ask? Find out with this pull of Nightbot! <laughs> Shit. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with these chalices. Maybe dinosaurs? Could be. Let me let me pull one. What what's what's the bot say? Hmm, yes, the mystical donut. Of course. So, is it a viable strategy to, like, go back the way I came and get some health? Because your boy, your boy is dying. I'm going to go back to the graveyard and get some life bottles. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> All right, nerds, I know how to spin. I have six health. Oh, God, I'm so dead. Well. Sometimes you just, uh, sometimes you just fucking game over. So, if I reload my save, it's gonna be like me stuck. Am I in a loop? Estoy looping? Because, uh,. I'm unsure how this is going to go. Oh shit, FMV. It's beautiful. <laughs> Gorgeous. Scarecrow fields. I really do. I I am. I have to play immaculately until I get healed, which is not going to be easy. The scarecrows are almost unstoppable, so don't be a hero. Try trapping them while you make your escape. All right, let me let me practice my Resident Evil. Go back to the crypt? Um, I don't think there were enemies in the crypt. I don't really remember if there was health either. I don't remember shit. Coin. All right, copper shield. I don't think there was health here. Uh, press select the button. Look at it wiggle. 
I got a life bottle at least. Holy shit, feels good, man. It was worth coming back. Blessed are we. Alright, so this time we don't fight the bird. I was thinking, you know, Resident Evil, attack the bird, it's gonna drop some shiny thing, and then I use that to collect a, or to complete a, a rare piece and sell it to the trader. Something about birds and spindle. Oh god. Help. 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 What the fuck? Why is he as fast as I am? Help. Alright, motherfucker. I thought maybe... Oh, I bet... Alright. I bet... I could use the club to light it on fire. Too bad my club be broke. Holy shit! I feel like I should have saved it after I picked up that life bottle, huh? Obliterated birds. Hmm. But this begs the question what I'm supposed to do because I don't exactly know. <gasps> Run away! Please stop. This is death by a thousand cuts. Arm. <laughs> I like that you can use your own arm as a weapon. They s it said the skeleton, the scarecrows are like nigh indestructible. Which is a little weird, not gonna lie. Oh my god. It said something about trapping them, but I can't go back and read the damn tooltip. Almost unstoppable, so don't be a hero. Try trapping them while you make your escape. Okay, so that doesn't help me with whatever the fuck's going on back here. <laughs> oh, I can probably push that. I'm probably overthinking this a lot. Or, you know, I'm not overthinking it at all. Fuck you, bird.
Beware of mischief makers and metal machines. Who knows what dark sorcery brings? Oh, I'm sorry, I needed. Uh, who knows what dark sorcery brings their metal limbs to life? It would be good to see the back of such menaces. Why do I feel like I'm about to die again? Bitch? Where do I? Ooh-ah. <laughs> ooh 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 Ow. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. ooh -ah. All right, so there is... I wonder if you can light the scarecrows on fire. It's probably something, right? I feel like I should be able to buy heals. Why can I need why can they buy heal? Though I should probably buy some crossbow bolts considering I fought two bosses in a row that kind of have required me to have them. That'll work. Ooh, wow. Beware the metal machine. I mean, don't think I don't see you. Huh. Oh, whatever. I can't do anything with it. Why does the throwing dagger suck so much? <laughs> All right. Cool, I guess. Switch to the club, you shits. Out of here. I'll happily take a club, though. Uh, do we? I don't think we try to light the scarecrow on fire yet. All right, that's that's trouble. Oh, wait, wait a second. That's filling up a life bottle. Oh, yes. Oh, oh. <coughs> oh I thought I was going to get, I thought I was going to get a whole bunch out of that. This one shoots. Bro, these throwing daggers suck shit. They're so bad. really bad. What if I charge it up? It actually does throw three. Alright. 
Chaos Room. Cool Katura, the Serpent Lord, yearns to fight alongside you, but has been captured by Zarok and sealed within a chest. Free this mighty spirit and earn a powerful ally. Oh no, cornfields, bro. Hey, what did I just target? Oh, bird. Of course. Oh, fuck you, birds! Y'all want some? I'm running light speed, B. Get out of here. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh! There's some cursed thing in the god. I wanted to test to see how quick it is. Apparently, it is stupid quick. And I lost two life bottles for that. How am I supposed to get over there? <laughs> Fuck you, bird. <laughs> No! I have unleashed the devils! <laughs> this is super shit! Bruh. I'm glad life bottles are not necessarily like the only way to res that if you get extra heals that also works but now what uh, oh god what are you ooing you motherfucker Can you burn the piles? Good question. I can burn myself? Yes, you can. Man. I want to know how to go back and get that damn... There's something behind that pile? Possibly. It can't touch the fields, that's super bad. <gasps> Fuck! <laughs> I ran into the wall because the camera! You son of a bitch! What is this? Help! Oh my god! Yep, 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 there's platforming involved! Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. I was doing... I was doing pretty okay, actually. I felt like I was doing okay, and then I wasted two life bottles in the damn... ...in the maze.
I have to go back for uh I have to go back into Dan's crypt because I didn't save it. Back. We'll probably do like thirty more minutes of this and then I'll call it a day. Seems appropriate. That, click that. Yeah, there's probably some more stuff in there. All right, now th this will be a completely different experience since I know what I'm doing. There's nothing more spiritual than medieval. Why spiritual? This guy's name is Dan, right? Daniel F uh, F Fortescue? I didn't save it again! Oh no, here we go. Alright, alright. Run by, run by the skeleton or the scarecrows. Smack the 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 the, the wagon, wagon question mark. But can we smack the wagon the other way? Nope. Help! God damn! What even hit me just now? Oh no! It's literally sitting at the spot I need to be. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm just running around. Dan the fan. He's Dan the man. Skeleton bones. My bones. Speaking of my bones. All right. Needs more smash. All right, good energy vial. It means there's no point in not. You s son of a bitch! All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Bring it on, bitch! Remember, contact damage bad. Mission accomplished. Get me out of here. Skeletor prequel. We all need a skeleton in our life to ask us to suck my bone, he man. My health. My health! I hit the damn chest instead of smash. And then I picked- alright, whatever. I picked up the damn club. Alright, there we go. Ah, oh, see, and this is where we get all that life back. The bats deserve it, let's be real. They deserve it wholeheartedly. How you doing, Nefarious? Nefarious, Dr. Nefariously Handsome. It's a fantastic tag. Suck egg. Every game has bats. Every game has like the filler, the, the spiders and the snakes 
and if it's an RPG, it's got a slime of some sort. You know, if I actually paid attention to what I was doing, maybe I wouldn't be getting my ass kicked. Alright, I don't need the money from the other section, so I'm just gonna go. I hate the birds. I hate birds! All birds! Medieval doesn't have spiders, but it has ants. It doesn't have spiders. This kind of game doesn't have spiders, really? Oh no, get me out! All I wanted to do was turn around. And he wide turned. He wide turned! One, two, three. Okay, I have three life bottles this time. I'm ready. I am absolutely not ready, but we can pretend I am. Shit. Well, I mean, when you think about how ants can carry, like, what is it, 30 times their own body weight? Giant insects. What up, Everweather? Yo, I am swole. All right, how many life bottles am I about to use? I'm guessing two. All right. Never mind. <laughs> what the fuck? Is there a crouch button? Oh my god, I didn't even get hit! Shame you skipped all the secrets, but I'll let you... <laughs> I'll let you this one. I... If they were involved in the maze, I don't know how to do the maze. Uh. I got a harvester part? Is that good? Pumpkin gourds dead ahead. The nursery to gather me as favorite side dish. Step inside and understand the true horror of fruit gone bad. Fruit and water, boys. Fruit and water. Even if it's bad fruit. I ate a banana for the first time in like two years yesterday. The day before yesterday. And all it did was reinforce the fact that banana is so middle of the road. Ugh. How can anyone ever say banana is their favorite fruit? It's so bland. It's not bland necessarily, but like its flavor is mild, right? I don't know. I didn't get the chalice there. That was the first one I haven't gotten the chalice on. I think that happened because I was freaking out about the indestructible scarecrows and me walking in with 16 health and realistically so many other problems. I don't know why I saved it twice, but we're going. Favorite are grapes? Hell yeah, grapes are good. 
I think it's on my bucket list to try one of those Japanese ruby grapes one day. You know, because they're like the size of your fist. Alright. You can't stop me! <laughs> this is MXC, baby! I'm traveling a million miles an hour! I learned the course. Ow. Alright, they may be able to eventually stop me. The death by a thousand cuts will eventually get me. Contact damage! My bones! Contact damage, my bones! I need the rune. Alright, hint. Any kind of fire kills scarecrows in a second. That would make sense. It absolutely would. There's, uh, there's, there's, there's a bottle. Oh my god, dude. Alright, I'm gonna take it slow. Bastards. Damn, they got some health. Bro, the contact damage is so real. So this is how the new players play this. Not with care, but with the almost admirable not giving a fuck attitude. Yeah. I got business. This game can't stop me from business. I mean, this looks like some kind of speedway in a uh, Donkey Kong racing or something. I can't see shit! I should still be able to buy health. Let me buy health. Here at Magic MD, we take the time to beat as a suggestion and not as an average. <laughs> Rust. Get, get out of here. Okay, so that looped back here, which is fine. We're gonna take it slow. I know the pumpkins can be killed now, so that's... That's good. Uh... Alright, that clearly is going down, so this way. Well, I sound old calling this a masterpiece. No, I mean, you like what you like. You know, I grew up with the Super Nintendo and PlayStation 1. I played, like, one of my favorite games of all time is Final Fantasy VI. Final Fantasy II was a masterpiece, don't at me. sometimes not sure if I should but I do hey uh, spits who taught them how to spit okay that was something oh yes 
I never grew up with this. Played it two years ago. Really? I, I, I this may be. I don't know. This, this may be a zoomer in me. Do I have zoomer? I don't even know at this point. But it might be. And that, um. God, I can't believe I just, like, unironically said zoomer. Uh. Most of the stuff that I know and love that's old is stuff I played way back when. It, it's the nostalgia. But I can't go back. I, I have yet to go back to a game at the PlayStation 1 era, to one I haven't played, and been like, this is one of my favorite games of all time. That hasn't happened to me yet, is what I'm trying to get at. Like, realistically, I think the only games... I don't know. Sir, Final Fantasy Tactics? I played Tactics when I was like 10. Contact damage! Yeah, that is PS1 era. Well, what I'm saying is I haven't gone back to the PS1 era and played a game I haven't played before and been like, this is this game is amazing and I love it. I've never done that and I can't... I, I mean, I, I shouldn't say I can't, but until it happens, I can't. What about Castlevania Symphony of the Night? I haven't played that one. Maybe if I go back to it. But, alright, so, it, as an example, I recently played um, A Link to the Past for the first time. Like, a, a year or so ago. And playing it, I know it's some people's favorite game of all time, right? I played it and it was like... Eh, eh. It's good. Up and down these magical mushrooms go. It will take you higher and higher, but be careful not to fall and sink without a trace. Oh no, more platforming, bro? I can't. Platforming is gonna kick my ass. Imagine playing Link to the Past. I know, right? So far, I have been thoroughly enjoying this game. It's been very good. The platforming is going to bug me. I'm going to complain about it, so I hope you bear with me on that because I'm not good at platforming, nor have I ever been good at platforming. I'm surprised that went so well first try. Spin? Oh, nice. That's why I'm perfect for retro stuff. Never played this before, so I have no nostalgia. I'm a pretentious prick and I play Dark Souls. <laughs> Alright, so we talk about, like, if I have a top 10 list, I have to consider what's on it, right? Most of it's just nostalgia bait, for the most part. You know, I've got my Final Fantasy VI, my Final Fantasy Tactics, my Burnout 3, or Take, you know, Take Down or Revenge. I really don't, they're all the same. They're all amazing. My Halo 2s, it's just nostalgia bait. And then I've got Dark Souls and Outer Wild somewhere on there. I don't know where exactly, but they're there. Though at this point, Dark Souls is like 10 years old, isn't it? Is that nostalgia bait? I feel like Dark Souls came out in like 2012 or something. Oh, I'm in this area. I'd say many retro games are not spectacular, but some are masterpieces to this day, like Medieval 1, Symphony of the Light, or Symphony of the Night, and Banjo Kazooie. See, I haven't played any of those. I don't know what I would. Star Room. <gasps> How did I jump that? That is terrifying. There was like one possible way I die there, and I died.
Yeah. Went back to play DK64 a while ago. To say controls like a boat is being generous. That's a lot of these retro games kind of have that issue in particular. The controls are not glamorous. And I've already been complaining about contact damage. That, number one. And, uh... The camera has been driving me nuts. Um... I have an earth rune. I have not seen earth claw thing. Why do people consider Mario 64 better than Kazooie? I like 64, but Kazooie is creative, funny, and push what 64 games could be. So I've never played Kazooie, but I can tell you the reason I like Mario 64 is that it's not a collect-a-thon. It is a level-based platformer. When I say 64, I mean Mario. It's a level-based platformer in which you are given a set piece and then you are allowed to like explore it and it changes based on your objective, which I find very good in my favorite style of platform. See, I think Mario Odyssey is a bit overrated because it is a collectathon and it drives me fucking nuts. Yo, that one fucking pumpkin just wrecked me. I think that has to do with Super Mario 64 being more popular at the time, being the first 3D Mario title, and the different mechanics in the game pretty much monumental at the time. See, that's... When did Kazooie come out in relation to Mario 64 as well? Super Mario 64 was, a. Uh, Earlier, wasn't it? This way? Sunshine just hurts to think about now, and I 100%ed it. Ugh. I feel like I'll probably go back to the sunshine one day just because I, I feel it's in the same vein as 64, right? Set pieces instead of just being a giant open world and collectible. Go, go collect all eight trillion moons. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Triple fuck. Can these things die? They don't stop coming and they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. Bruh, I don't feel like I'm knocking this thing down anymore. Maybe I need to kill the pumpkins? Oh, I have to kill the stupid roots! I'm trying to attack the thing in the middle and I have to hit the stuff on the outside. Oh my god. Idiot. That cost me so much. Cast fireball. All right. 
One of the things that makes me like collectathons is prioritizing stuff. Instead of wanting to 100% them, I want to beat them with doing what is fun to me. That's true. Well, that's, um, like Mario had, you didn't have to get every star, right? You only needed a certain amount. So if you run into a star you didn't want to get, you could just kind of move on. Which I feel is most games, but I get the open, the, the freedom to do what you want is pretty cool. All I'm saying is Ogre Battle 64 was peak in 64. No, StarCraft 64. Try again. Only 100% a few games in my life. Hollow Knight, Ruiner, The Messenger, Medieval 1. Collected all the stuff in Steam World 1 and 2, but not all Golden Stars. So, I haven't 100% in Hollow Knight, but it is one of my favorite games. So, I get that. That's It is a fantastic game by any stretch of the imagination! I just realized the life bottles are like energy tanks in Metroid. Okay. Stoy Lupin. Ugh, give me a sec. Star Fox 64 is also near the top. I got the magic percent for the last ending, but wasn't willing to do the entire Pantheon of Hollow Dust. That's- I'm not good enough in Hollow Knight to do the whole ass Pantheon, so... I could barely beat... Uh, uh, what is that motherfucker? Oh my god, I'm getting worked. What, what was this? The, 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 the circus guy. I could barely beat him. Grim. Please die. Please die. It jumped the sword? You crafty bitch! Oh my god, and two more spawned. I'm out. Later. Uh. Oh my god. All bow down before the master of the vegetable patch. The prize winning plant who can summon an army of cabbage with a wave of his noble tendril. He's delicious. He's nutritious. He's Zarok's secret recipe. He's the pumpkin king. <laughs> Mini dong. <laughs> Never did a uh, P5. It's just not fun. Oh, uh, Pantheon. I don't know. A lot of those. I'm not good enough for that shit. I see these videos and I know what's going on, and I'm like, I can do that. I can do that. Let's go. You know, I get full on Smasher, and then I get in the game, and my hands are just like decrepit old men. You know, like I can barely hold a drink. And it's, oh, baby, I can do this. Let's go. The brain don't catch up. The hands are like crying in agony. The pumpkin serpent. I'm curious to know if, uh, Nightbot, the amount of options it has, because I think it has, like, 15 options right now, and I have a, three different sets of 15 options. I'm curious to know if it'll cycle through them before replaying one. I doubt that's the case, but I could hope. The King Pumpkin sleeps. If you want an audience with this regal plant, you should mash all of his pod sacks. All right. Time to mesh. Ooh! No, it doesn't have to be this way. These pumpkins are too strong. I need stronger potions. I need stronger potions. I might need the strongest potion. Oh. 
Did I just take damage from the pod? That's not right. That's right, Rhino, a classic. I hate these things. I hate them so much. I... The camera! The camera! Must mash! How you doing, Rhino? Do you ever play this one? I don't like what the fuck's going on here. Played this one one and two, and you have the remaster. Oh shit! I feel like if I own a PlayStation Four or Three or whatever, I would have probably played the remaster. But there's a charm in playing the classic as well, right? I'm sure the camera would not piss me off as much as it has been should I have played the remaster instead. One down. Please stop. Yes! Oh, feels good, man. I missed a bot. Son of a bitch. One. A two. Three licks to get to the center. <laughs> hey. Please turn, camera. Bruh. What the fuck? This is a great Halloween game. I was recommended it for Halloween. But Halloween, I played so many other things, and then it, you know, it just never came up. So. Shit. I don't want to fuck with these things. I don't know what it's doing. I don't have a specialized camera. What are you attacking? Oh, it's trying to attack the stupid bomb. That's a good idea! Hit the bomb! That's a good idea. It didn't work. Come on, bitch. Throwing dynamite a martial art? Yo, I would be happy. I would be ecstatic to get some of the chalices in these levels if these pumpkins just weren't murder. And Lord, oh Lord, are they just murder? I guess this is a nightmare before Christmas. <coughs> oh, I think I just got AIDS. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this was a hella hard game. I'm noticing. I've game over to what, three times now?
It hasn't been pretty. I'll tell you that. I really... I need to get these chalices, I do. I, I need to make a more concerted effort to attempt to get the chalice. The sleeping... Whoa! Okay. Poor villagers. The master possesses them. It mustn't hurt them. Hurt guards, though. They seek out an object of great power. Sure. <laughs> well... Rhino, you have a thing about dolls? I could see how this would fuck you up. A good soul has been lost. Oh, I'm yeah, I'm not supposed to kill them, of course. Blacksmith's Monthly. Old man Willie Green of Gallows Town was awarded Smithy of the Season by our readers. His outstanding casts have produced many intricate and hard-wearing iron goods and sculptures. Willie only uses the finest of metals in his work and is particularly noted for his magnificent busts. Old man Willie was quoted as saying, Aye, when I get a pumpkin on me bellows, there's no stopping me. It's all in the rhythm, up and down, up and down. Always been inspired by the stories of Stan Yarn here, the greatest smithy that ever was. Up and down and up and down. It's all about the rhythm. I assume I'm gonna need to place something in there and then it's gonna do a mold and then. We make a key or something? I don't really know. Yeah, we have to not kill anyone here. Which is gonna be weird. How are we supposed to do this chalice? Water bad. I think it's the, uh, the graphics and stuff like that, but I'm getting a very Stratholm vibe from this. Please, small child. Please, small child, stop chasing me with an axe. What do we got going on here? I have not seen shit. All right, moon rune in here. Oh, Lord. I will worry about that puzzle, quote unquote puzzle, right? I'll worry about. <gasps> When I find the moon rune! Very good. Hey! Later! Look at all the warping textures, holy shit! Alright, new club. A lot of mice. Do you see they are uh, making a sequel to Plague Tale? Speaking of mice, Troll's Head. Bust of Mr. Shanks, landlord of the Troll's Head, to clean the statue, lower pedestal. Ow. 
or qua. Probably a switch, right? But like... Really see anything. Yeah, I don't know if uh, the new Plague Tale is something. I liked a Plague Tale Requiem, but it wasn't like outstanding or anything, you know? It was pretty good. That's about it. A weird mixture of like horror and grotesity. Grotesque. Grotesque. Ah! Earth room. Oh my god! Fuck off! Yeah, Daniel Grotescu, yep. Alright. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with that, but we'll find out! That's weird. I don't know what I would consider a staple of the stream, you know? Like, at one point, I wanted to say Life is Strange, but I don't feel the obligation I thought I would when Life is Strange 3 comes out. Like, came out, I should say. Hurry, comrades. Tear this place apart. If we don't find the Shadow Artifact, Lord Zarak will have us mocking out the demons for the next millennium. Oh god. At least I can kill these guys, right? Smack. 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 They got guns! It worked, son. Uh, what did I grab? The Chouse Rune? Chouse Rune. This part's good. But, you know, just once upon a time, I would have said Life is Strange is like this, this beast of the stream, you know? But after having played a good narrative game that is Detroit, I don't even want to play the new Life is Strange. There's so many fucking things. To whom it may concern, I must make haste, for Xerox men will be here within the hour. I have taken the crucifix from the church. It is the key to a key. I used the cross to make the attached cast. Then I had it destroyed. It is my hope that this cast falls into the hands of a just and good hero. Oh, I didn't... Heroes from history, a retrospective. Here's my five hour YouTube, right? YouTube video. Chapter one. In addition to being the strongest man who ever lived, Stanier Iron Hewer was unsurpassed in his skill as a blacksmith. He was equally happy pounding on his anvil at home as he was pounding on someone's head in battle. It was said that his only fear was the end of the village smithy as the focus of manufacture in favor of more centralized units. As if, oh God. Oh, God! No. <laughs> uh, damn, that guy hurt! Alright, we got our cast, which means we need the molten metal now, I think. He only uses the best metal in the smithy. Ugh.
kind of wish that would go a little faster, but it's fine. A crucifix once stood here, but the mayor took it. Find a replacement and see how the church should really look. We can at least put the, uh, the cast down, so... If nothing else. Melt it down! I'm beginning to think this ain't working. We need something else. Keep going? You're gonna... I'm gonna keep going and then this is... What? We're gonna be five minutes into it? I've banned people for less right now. <laughs> Alright, I'm not doing that. I'm looking around. There's gotta be something I missed. It's fine. Keep going. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ah, of course. It's the, uh, the real life problems, right? Metal doesn't instantly melt. We have to wait. Obviously. Some shit happening back there. I assume fixing the church opens that. Don't know about this. That was a waste of an energy vial, whatever. Maybe Rhino's actually right and I have to keep going or something. I don't know. The room key is held aloft by the flow of water from the fountain. Yeah. This was the blue, the moon rune. The blue moon rune. I got hit? On what fucking planet? Alright, garbage. Alright, stay looping. Oh boy. This isn't an actual thing, is it? It can't be. I get pumping on me bellows, it's all in the rhythm, up and down and up and down and up and down. Oh shit. Hey, it automatically opened. Dear sir or madam, on my travels across Galamia, I have come across many mysterious and enchanting finds. That which, or however, that which filled me with the deepest dread was discovery of the tomb of the shadow demons. The key to the dank prison, a mysterious shadow artifact, is now in my possession. That dress-wearing bully boy, Zarek, will stop at nothing to retrieve this item. I fear that he already knows that it is I who possess it. Yours fearfully, the town mayor. Yeah, 
Yours fearfully. Who would... I love the idea of signing a letter like that. Yours fearfully. Yours in worse health. Okay, I popped out of that and then got some real actual like Nightmare Before Christmas vibes. Like specifically having never actually watched, I mean, or you know, whatever that shit is. Having never watched that movie, the Kingdom Hearts thing, the level in Kingdom Hearts. That's what I was reminded of. Contact damage is so real! Damn, son, I got worked. 90%? 90? What do you mean 90? Is that not everyone? I'm not supposed to kill children, am I? What do you mean, 90? Like, I don't think I'm supposed to kill these people. But I didn't see any other guards, did you guys? I didn't fucking see shit. Because this guy down here, I'm pretty sure he's a normal person. And I'm not supposed to touch him. And I feel like I've been up and down and all around this whole outside section. Looks like fire. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to kill him. Maybe there's some kind of secret bonus I don't know about. I guess there's behind this gate. All right, let's let's assume I have to come back for that. We'll go in, do whatever this shit is. There'll still be that one section, right? Or will I do whatever this shit this is? Fucking what? What? What's the point of this place? Oh. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The roof. He's got Please, dear God, get me out. Bruh. Bruh. I am double tap. Please sprint. All right. Okay. 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 In. Beautiful. All right, door open. Good. Sword. No?
I don't know. The camera? What about it? Oh, there's some severe warping going on here. What? to do something with this. Okay. Did I not hit it earlier? It's gotta be super specific. Every time. Ready to hammer! Let's go collect that crucible. Alright, I'm gonna finish this level and then I'm gonna be done for the day. So we're gonna go grab the crucible, leave, and then I'll be done. Um. The Hall of Heroes awaits. This is the first time in what three levels that I've gotten the Hall of Heroes? Shit. Smash. You know, I could have had this section completely finished. Oh, new weapon! Yes. Fortescue, you jawless arrow magnet! What the fuck? What are you doing back here? <laughs> what? Call me Mr. Woden the Mighty! How I pity the people of Galomir that their fate should once again be in the hands of a chump like you! Still, I suppose it's not fair to take it out on them. Take my sword, and do try not to stab yourself in the foot. You know, I've always had my doubts about you, Fortescue. You're just not cut from hero material. Oh, fuck you, old man. Give me that. Oh, look at the sword. What? <laughs> oh, there we go. You gotta get the rhythm right. Remember, it's all about that up and down. Up and down and up and down. <laughs> Bro, it's smooth. Cool. What is it? Just, okay. Door had not loaded. So what? Two chalices? One chalice will finish the back left. And then we get our picture or our, our thing right here. It'll be beautiful. All right, let me get the fuck out of here. Oh, shit. That's a good stretch. Oh, damn. Five chalice. All right, so that's going to do it for today. Um, I'll pick back up same time tomorrow with Beyond Two Souls. And if you want to watch this, this will continue Friday at 3 Eastern. So set your alarm if you want to see this. And uh, otherwise, I hope you all enjoy the rest of your evening. I'm going